Enigmas of Gender and Cooperation in Social Dilemmas, when the classic prisoner's dilemma game is played repeatedly over many rounds, is cooperation maintained? And do male pairs cooperate almost twice as much as female pairs? Both findings were reported in a very large U.S. experiment published over half a century ago. Now, an experimental study using more rigorous methodological and statistical techniques and much larger financial incentives have corroborated both major findings in a UK population, despite major shifts in the status of women and gender attitudes over the intervening decades. A research group from the University of Leicester, UK Andrew Coleman, Bryony Pulford, and Eva Krokow investigated cooperation in a computer-controlled experiment in which 150 men and women played 300 rounds of two different PD games in fixed pairs. According to game theory, rational players who know in advance the number of rounds that they will be playing should defect on every round, because defection pays better than cooperation whether the other person cooperates or defects, but experiments invariably find high levels of cooperation. Research indicates cooperation declines in repeated prisoners' dilemma due to end-game effects rather than consistent trends. Leicester researchers confirmed no significant decline overall, but noted gender differences, with women showing less cooperation than men. It is much larger than most psychological gender differences and runs counter to conventional sex role stereotypes. In the UK experiment, cooperation levels were unaffected by co-players' genders, as participants were unaware of them. Our most important finding was that the frequently claimed decline in cooperation over repetitions appears to be a misconception, perhaps driven by an expectation that there ought to be a steady convergence toward the game-theoretic equilibrium of joint defection as players come to understand the game better through experience. On the gender difference in cooperation, Professor Coleman suggests women's social orientation may lead to gender differences in game strategies like PD and chicken, focusing on relative payoffs rather than absolute ones, challenging the idea of risk aversion.